This is WVUA 23 News at 10. We're glad to be with you tonight. I'm Jabari Pruitt. The talk today has been all about Super Bowl 52. While the game was played in Minnesota, you could still feel the energy right here. WVUA 23's Emily Mosner joins us live tonight from the studio. And Emily, you caught up with fans right here in Tuscaloosa. That's right, Jabari. As we both know, Tuscaloosa is a football town. So despite not cheering on the Tide, everyone I spoke to was super excited about watching the Super Bowl game tonight. Super Bowl 52. The New England Patriots making their 10th Super Bowl appearance versus the Philadelphia Eagles making their third Super Bowl appearance. I caught up with some football fans before the game to see who they were pulling for. Patriots. Uh, the Eagles, definitely. The Patriots. Uh, the Patriots. The Eagles, fly high, baby. I'm super duper excited for the Eagles. We do not want New England Patriots, okay? As for scoring predictions. I think they're going to dominate. I'm predicting 35-10, uh, final score, Patriots. For some fans, the food can be just as important as the game. All the food All today. the spread. We have rotel dip, dip, buffalo chicken dip, lemon cupcakes, puppy chow mix, what else? Some party dip. You know, all everything, the food, all, all the, the food. food. Everything from Super Bowl themed cupcakes, chips and appetizers are popular on game day. Stores such as Target know exactly what to stock up on before the big day. Order a, more, a lot more um, of your Tostitos, your salsa, a lot more um, beer is uh, pre-ordered. Now the final score was 41-33 Philadelphia Eagles. On a side note, a University of Alabama graduate, Scott Edwards, served as a sideline official during the Super Bowl game. Live in the studio, Emily Moser, WVUA 23 News. Emily, thank you.